you want to see some serious mental illness. I mean, real religious delusions. I present to you a clip of Republican presidential candidate Ted Cruz's father, Rafael Cruz, on a religious program called Focus Today on the Dove TV. Rafael Cruz explained this completely bizarre story of how before Ted Cruz declared he was going to run for president, he and his family and Rafael as well, they all spent six months in prayer trying to figure out whether Ted Cruz should try to become the president. And ultimately, it was something that God or the Holy Spirit communicated to Ted Cruz's wife, Heidi Cruz, that convinced Ted Cruz that God indeed wants him to run for president. Let's take a look at the video. This is very disturbing stuff. I mean, if there are children in the room, I really would not let the kids watch this because this stuff will rot your brain. OK, as adults, hopefully we're prepared to handle it. Let's take a look. I would assume you correct me that you and your family and especially Ted have been called to run for president. How do you pray for him? Well, I'll tell you, the decision to run for president of Ted was a long, long uh, decision. Ted and his wife and family, they spent six months in prayer. Right just seeking the will of God as to what to do. Mm. And that uh, culminated uh, one time uh, that uh, the whole family was together. Mm -hmm. And even his senior staff, we were at, uh, attending a church service all together at First Baptist Church of Houston, mm -hmm. where he's a member. And after church, we went up to the pastor's office. We spent two hours on our knees seeking God's will about this decision Go on. and it was there where Heidi said a word that uh, you know I believe it was just inspiration from God and she said seek God's face not God's hand and that was just as if there was a a, a, a presence of the Holy Spirit in the room and that you know we all were at all and Ted just all that it came out of his mouth he said he said hear my Lord right this is what happened Lewis when God told Heidi Cruz to seek God's face instead of God's hand imagine what we would be dealing with today if God had told Heidi Cruz to go seek God's groin I mean things really could have gotten ugly I, I think it's I don't really know what happens that, that people think the Lord has communicated with them. Yeah, I mean, it really could be anything, right? Sure. A, a, a dove could fly by the window, uh, a book could fall off a shelf, and they think, this is God speaking to me. Yeah, Ted Cruz is not just dangerous. Uh, I mean, he, he is not just an extremist conservative whose ideas bear no connection to the real world. Ted Cruz's family, including in particular his father, Rafael Cruz, they've convinced themselves and apparently Ted Cruz that Cruz has somehow been anointed by God to bring about the return of Jesus or of Jesus a Jesus like period to the world or the United States. If you thought it was bad when George W. Bush prayed and God told him to go into Iraq, right? If you're still reeling from the consequences of what George W. Bush thought God told him, just wait until you have a president who thinks his entire candidacy and presidency were planned specifically by God to bring about the second coming of Christ. That is going to be ugly, Lewis. You can't even imagine the likes of that. Quite ugly. And if he loses, I can't wait to hear the explanation. The online news world is getting pretty cluttered with lots of nonsense. There's the so-called news sites that just rewrite news articles, and then there's the websites we all know that we just can't trust. Lately, I've been reading Smash Pipe, which is an online magazine that does original alternative news and satirical news with an unapologetic perspective and a roving moral center. Smash Pipe is less interested in trending topics than in what's actually going on, and Smash Pipe has no ads whatsoever other than reader-generated classified ads, and they never will. Smash Pipe is what happens when you on a bad day, stub your toe on the miseries and mysteries of life. Check it out at smashpipe.com.